this is my husband, Jarvis. What are you doing here today? We're here to match dogs with their owners. Do you think you'll be good at that? I think I will be. I work with dogs full time, walking them, training them. I don't like dogs. So how come? Uh, well, first obvious reason, they smell horrible. I'm a, like, a, like a fish type person. Do y'all have dogs? Yes. What are your dogs' names? Bolt and Soju. What kind of dogs are they? Pit bulls. Oh. <laughs> Straight pits. What are some uh, stereotypes about puppy parents? I mean, they act like baby parents. Yeah, basically. <laughs> they feel like their dogs are welcome everywhere. They're just not welcome at my house. They're not welcome in my car. I'm gonna bring the people out first. Kind of let you take a look at them. All right. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. Okay. Oh, oh. oh my goodness. Mm. This is Frankie. Okay. <laughs> Can I gonna look at you? Hi. Do you have a lot of Dobsons that you've worked with? I do. Shout out Doug and Joni. Are those Dobsons you've worked with? Those are Dobsons I work with. <laughs> well, let's just have you come up first. <laughs> okay. Like the spots here, the sweater, maybe. Dress like your dog a little bit. How long are your work days? My work days? Yeah. I work like nine to five. What does your dog do when you're away? Uh, I'm home. You work from home? Yeah. Okay. Her hat kind of matches like the style of the dog. Do you have any other pets? I have four cats. Oh, okay. <laughs> hmm. Some cats would probably tear you up. I don't yeah. think this is your dog. Okay. <laughs> Do you like little dogs? I've had a toy chihuahua before, so. Okay. Yeah. I don't think this is her dog. Why? The Thanks. dog is shaky. <laughs> <laughs> What do you want to switch her out with? Um, maybe him. He needs a, a papa type <laughs> energy. Hi. Hi. Hello. So how, do you have any other pets right now? Currently, one other dog. What kind of dog is it and how old are they? Um, it's a pit bull and it's three years old. Okay. Oh. Um, what's their name? Hank. Hank, Hank and, and Frank. Frankie. Oh, Hank, uh, Hank and Frank. Oh, oh, this is your dog. <laughs> this feels right. He looks like this is my dad. This is my son. Yeah. I think that's my guess. Okay. Here you go, Frank. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, oh where are you going? This is Lily. Lily. Lily is deaf, just so you know. Oh. I really think this is your dog. <laughs> you wanna <laughs> treat that? Um, well, it looks like he's also attracted to you. <laughs> Do you have any additional pets besides the puppy that you have today? Yes, I have one cat. Do you live in a house or apartment? Apartment. Apartment as well. Can I ask you some questions? Sure. Is your puppy your first puppy? No. How do you like to spend your uh, weekends with your dog? Luckily for me, my puppy likes to sleep a lot, but I also take my puppy everywhere with me, so we hang out, go out for dinner. How often do you walk your dog? Every couple of hours. Every couple yeah. hours. Oh, this your dog. <laughs> I just forgot. Just the obedience yeah, right there. Obedience straight up. Just <laughs> Is your puppy pretty chill around other dogs and people? Very chill. Oh, would you like me to pet the dog? I would love it if you'd pet the dog. <laughs> I'm feeling similar vibes from both Lily and who I think is Lily's mom. I'm gonna lock in that guess. Oh, I have to hold this one? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is Millie. You're kind of cute, though. What kind of person do you think would own a dog like that? What's the temperament of the person? Super duper chill. Is your puppy your first puppy? Yes. Yes. Where did you get your puppy? From a breeder. From a breeder. <laughs> what are you looking for? I don't think this is a purebred dog. You've got mutt vibes. Why did you get a new puppy? Because uh, I'm in between right now uh, classes. I'm okay. a full time student, and so okay. it was the perfect time to get a dog. Why did you choose your dog's name? I just thought it was a really cute name for a dog. Hi, Millie. Do you know how to Millie rock? Huh. Oh, you don't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was a very random. <laughs> Do you consider yourself chill? I consider myself chill. Yeah, he's yeah. very chill, and he looks well loved. And you look like you smile all the time and stuff, so he's like, you see that. <laughs> That's your dog. Hi. Hello. This is Sage. Hi, Sage. Sage. But, oh my Sage God. Sage is like, no, I don't want to be with you guys. Oh. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no, no, come here. Come. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Who's, who's this over here? Let me give you this dog and see what happens. 
Have you had any dogs before? I've had one dog before. Okay, what were they like? Very energetic. What kind of dog was that? Golden Retriever. Golden Retriever? Yeah. Who do you belong to? Is it him? It's him, isn't it? This dog does match your style, and I think you're able to handle this dog. I think the sage is yours. Okay. Boom. You First agree? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, don't tell me it's a golden retriever. Have I made a mistake? <laughs> this dog is Charlie. Charlie. Hi, Charlie. English cream retrievers. I absolutely adore these dogs. They're the doofuses of the golden retriever kingdom. I think you would name your dog Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure what that's supposed to mean, but all right. Yeah, hey, uh, because Charlie's like a homeboy name for a dog. What did you look for in a puppy when you were looking? Um, someone to chill with, someone to take home to and cuddle. <laughs> sure. And did your puppy come from a rescue? Did they come from a breeder? Yeah. What made you get a new puppy? Um, I'm a college student, and I just wanted a companion. How much did you pay for your dog? Okay, you I lunch? paid 1200 for my dog. Oh, this changes up the game. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm getting cuddly vibes out of this one. This is my guess. Why did you say her? Well, I'm assuming an English cream retriever came from a breeder. If you like to cuddle, this is a really good dog to have. Oh my oh. gosh. It's your people. <laughs> There you go, there you go. Okay. All right, all right. Oh, oh, you chill. Okay. You two have pit bulls. What would it take to have a pit bull? Um. I mean, a house, I feel like. This dog is loud, so this cannot be in an apartment. I'm sticking to it. I'm like. Oh my gosh. How do you and your dog typically spend your, your time together? We walk for 30 minutes three times a day. We play a lot of tug. We go on a lot of adventures. Okay. My dog's very cuddly. Loves kisses? Loves kisses. That is all I needed to hear. <laughs> Wait, why'd you say that? Have you ever met a land seal that doesn't want to just lick your face off? A land seal? Do you like to lick? Yes, you do. So I think got one person left. Who's the one person you have left? That's not her dog. I feel like I know who's who to switch to. Okay, who do you want to give him to then? I want to give him to him, this dog to her. I feel like you two should switch. Let's take it around this way. <laughs> he, he knows how to put the leash down. That's his dog. Final answer. <laughs> All right, raise your hand if they got you right. Nobody? We got everybody else? That was that bad? Oh. <laughs> if you could make a switch to see if it was right, what would you switch? Okay, Frank is gonna go over here. Sage is gonna go over here. Go to mama, yes. And then Charlie's gonna come over here. And now, I think I nailed it. Now raise your hand if he switched you correctly. Yay! <laughs> go ahead and call the first person. All right, come on up. Why did you get Sage? Um, I got her because I was going through a transition in my life, mm -hmm. and I named her Sage because she was cleansing out some energy. That makes sense, yeah. and that name makes sense to your vibe. What, what do you mean by that? <laughs> because you tell she's like, you know, <laughs> Sage the house, open all the windows. How much did you pay for your dog? Um, I got her from the Seattle Humane, so it was like 500. Aww. Yeah. This is Charlie. He's a 11 and a half week old purebred English cream golden retriever. Would you describe your dog as a doof? Uh, he's very clumsy, yes, but he's also very intelligent. Totally. He gets uh, commands pretty easily. He looks very eager to please, which makes a, a very trainable puppy. Now, how much did you pay for that dog? From the breeder, it was 800, then I had to pay another 600 in deposits. Mm -hmm. Oh, damn. Yeah. yeah, so about 1400 total. Why get a new puppy? My girlfriend and I, we've been looking at getting a dog mm -hmm. ever since we've been together, and this was just the perfect time to do it. So if you and your girlfriend break up, who takes the oh, dog? Oh, I am taking Charlie. Are you guys going to like yeah. do visitation rights? I will give stuff? her visitation rights, but I do 90% of the training, and I do 95% of the financing for this dog. Frankie's mom. Here's Frank. Do you look like we match? I can see it now. You said you're a big cuddler, and that looks like a cuddly puppy. He's a cuddler. It makes sense. He is so chill. What is he on? Is he? Yeah, he's, he's on. He's not on anything. <laughs> <laughs> no, you should, see, you should see his face right now. He's like. It's like something. Yeah, he's... Yeah. Well, you got us wrong. 
But does the big definitely. pop energy match now? <laughs> yes, it definitely matches. He's half pit bull and then he's half bully XL, so he's gonna be one of those guys walking around with the big muscles. Ask him, was he worried about getting a pit bull? Were you worried about that? I mean, there's a lot of judgment for sure. And people, when they hear him making a lot of noise, they think he's gonna hurt him, but mm. he's the sweetest thing. He's just really excited. Clearly. Ah. Woo. <laughs> so, how'd you know? Um, well, you know, you said your dog to be really active and be outside, and this struck me as a as a dog that would like to be outside with you. I appreciate, too, that you mentioned that he could be cuddly or kissy, because I think a lot of people just assume pit bulls are going to be aggressive sure. or they're not very intelligent. <laughs> I've been Frenched by so many pities in my day. Why Millie? Uh, so my grandma had a chihuahua that she adopted that was named Sierra, and that's my name. So I was like, why don't I name my dog Millie after my grandma? And how old is Millie? Yeah, yeah. four and a half. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you kind of like this dog, right? The, well, yeah, because it's like the like most calmest. It doesn't seem like it needs much attention, you know? It just wants to sleep. It's acceptable. I'm Jen, this is Lily. Lily. I can see it. Yeah, yeah. Y'all be walking down, looking yeah. fly. Yeah. How did you end up with a deaf dog? We were looking for a new puppy, and we saw her online, and my daughter really wanted her. So I called the breeders. They sent us a picture of her sister, and they said, take this dog instead. They tried to keep her from us, and they told us she was deaf. It's we had to find the right family, so I convinced them that was us. So she has a hand sign. It's like a little L, like a bunny hopping. And like, if I really need her attention, I'll do the L like really quick. And I saw your boots. I was like, these strike me as French Bulldog boots. Also, you were looking very longingly toward this puppy. Oh, no. Okay. How was that? Um, it was interesting. Do you think you like puppies a little bit more? No, I'm pretty much the same. I'm like, <laughs> hi and, and bye type thing. I'm the same. Truth or Drink and Kiwi 100 are now available at Target. Big news for us. Can you believe it? It's now at Target. Thank you so much for your support, everyone, and I'm gonna go play the game.